Hey everyone, it's LB here. I am super excited to show you an unboxing of a wristlet I got from Brahmin in the color Sangria Melbourne. Okay, so here it is. Um, I was super curious about the, what this color looked like when I was ordering it, so I'm very excited to see how it turns out. Inside we have this. So this, oh, it's all in one package, okay. Good to know, empty box. So once I get this out, I will be showing it in multiple light situations because I wanted to see what the color looked like. I could not find much out there on it. Um, I'll link the Brahmin link that I bought this from. It has some images of it. And then I found some additional ones on Amazon that looked more iridescent. So I'll put that link down there too if you wanna look at it. But I will be showing you what this looks like in different lighting conditions so you can judge for yourself based on what I'm showing if it's the color for you or not. All right, so the cardboard papers come off and here it is. Oh, it is so iridescent and pretty. Take that off. Here's the tag. And this color was 95. They have some that are more expensive, but this is the color I wanted. Open it up. Take out the stuffing inside. We do have a dust bag to store it in. It's actually pretty big, the dust bag compared to the wristlet itself. But yeah, here it is. Let's look at the inside. There's no outer pocket, but there is an inner zipper pocket. And the lining and then the pull on the zipper on the inside matches the Sangria Melbourne exterior. So pretty. I'm very excited to use this and to see what all fits into it. And here's a little envelope, I guess, with the information about the bag or the wristlet and some desiccant. Let's see what this says. So a Brahmin card. This is the registration. And then this one is some care, it looks like, instructions, which will be good. So those were in this cute little envelope in the zipper pocket. But here is what the zipper pocket looks like, empty. And I got this because I think it's the perfect size to put my phone, my wallet, my keys, an ID, you know, just a few little things in and take with me on the go. I wanted a Brahmin wristlet because I had purchased this Pecan Melbourne bag at an auction and the outside is in such good condition. But it's the perfect crossbody length. I don't know what style this is, but I thought, hey, I wanted something. And according to measurements, this should fit perfectly. Yeah, that I could put in here. But then if I don't want to carry the full bag, easily take out and put this somewhere else and just carry this with me. I also wanted a color that looked good with the Pecan Melbourne, but also looked good with the black because I do have a bunch of black purses. So I thought it would be nice to stick this into a black bag and not have it be clashing. So this was just kind of a generic, beautiful color for me all around. So hopefully this turns out exactly as I wanted. Seeing the wear and tear on the pre-loved one I bought and the condition of the outside made me really interested in using this as kind of an everyday wristlet. Here is the tag for what we have here. The Daisy wristlet in the Sangria Melbourne. Genuine leather. It kind of smells like a bag, but nothing, nothing too outstanding in the way that it smells. Sometimes I like the smell of good bags, but there you have it. This is my new Brahmin wristlet. Oh, looks like there's a tag here. I'll remove that so that I can detach this if needed, although I am planning to keep it with the wristlet handle and carry it with me as I need to. So yeah, beautiful bag. This is gorgeous. I'm really happy with the way that it looks and I don't plan to store it in the dust bag, but it does come with a nice big dust bag. Um, with plenty of space to store it or anything else that you need to store in a dust bag, you could use this. Um, it's only coming to here and here on this whole size. So pretty nice. It's a very nice dust bag. Anyway, 
that is all. I will put some more shots in of what this color looks like in different lighting. The size of it is pretty simple. I'll copy the dimensions from the website into the description if you want to just check them out and see how big this this wristlet actually is. And if you want me to do a follow-up on what all I can fit in it later, let me know because I don't know yet. I have not started using this since clearly I just opened it. That's all I have to describe this. And now I'm going to give you some shots of it in various types of lighting after I cut the tags off. All right, here we are in mixed light from my dining room. There's some natural light coming in behind me and then the light from the lamp in my dining room. Again, very beautiful. What I really wanted to show was that I ended up putting the price tag in the envelope with the care instructions. So I was a little bit worried because it's slightly longer, but everything fit in just fine. The registration card. And this card is where it says to keep away from sunlight, water, and heat, which can damage the look and the shape. So no sanitizer or perfume should color it if you don't want it to discolor. So good stuff here. Um, and I will be researching more on how to care for these bags because I have one I need to clean now, my one from the auction. So yeah, here we go. The price tag and then I also noticed on the inside there is a little ribbon which says brahmin.com made in Cambodia and then it's got a number on it. So I don't know if that's the item number or how that works, but it does not, it does not match the number on here. Anyway, there you have it. And another place of lighting and just to show you a little bit more about the cards and the price tag all fitting within this black envelope, which I plan to keep in the dust bag. For natural sunlight, we are out in my driveway. So how the iridescence looks on the Sangria Melbourne. So pretty. Fluorescent light. the wristlet under LED light with no natural light. These are just LED bulbs in my family room. And now it's cloudy outside. So I figured I'd show what it looks like in this light. And as you would expect, this bag is much more gorgeous in person. So check it out with your own eyes if you can.